super scale out virtual data warehousing featuring Green Plum and VMware. In our demonstration, we currently have eight segment servers that are online. The segment servers are connected to each other via a high speed private network. We also have two master servers. The master server maintains metadata and statistics on the stored data that it receives. It builds a parallel query plan and dispatches it to the segments for execution. Additionally, we have eight more segment servers which are in a suspend state. They can be easily brought online in a virtual environment or deployed depending upon need or demand. Lastly, we have 16 more Greenplum servers that are set in suspend state in the folder 32 node which can be brought online. One of the benefits of doing this in a virtual environment is that we can leverage things like templates, cloning, DRS, and high availability. Now this particular set of servers has been set up to model a data warehouse environment. We have a database set up that has 12 million rows. We're going to run three sets of queries against this database, once with the eight servers, once with 16, and one with 32. As we run these queries, you'll notice from the screen that the load times will become shorter and the response times also become shorter. One, in, one note about Greenplum is that Green, Greenplum gives you the ability to provide dynamic pool of servers that will run analytics and analyze information and do it in a very short period of time. We'll run our first set of queries using eight of our 32 Greenplum segment servers. The database is reloaded, the query is set off, and the results will be displayed on the screen. Please note that each result is seen as response time for the query run against the loaded data. As we continue to add Greenplum servers, you'll notice that the load time and response times become shorter and shorter and shorter. Now let's move ahead and power on our next set of eight segment servers. We'll return to the graphical interface, power them on. This will be reflected in the recent tasks bar, and we're now ready to run our query again now using 16 of our 32 Greenplum segment servers. The database is reloaded and the query is set for a second time. Again, the output of, of the search is displayed on our screen. This is our time to query with our 16 node environment. Lastly, will power on the remaining 16 Greenplum segment servers, giving us a total of 32. We return to the interface, power these on, again reflected in the recent tasks. Once the machines are powered on, we'll run our query for the third time. The database is reloaded, the query kicked off, and the output displayed on the screen. Now let's take a look at our result comparisons. When we started off, we ran our, our query with an 8-node environment. That took 8,911 milliseconds. When we increased it to a 16-node environment, our time dropped to 5,331 milliseconds. And then finally, at a full 32-node environment, we were at 2,786 milliseconds. To recap, as you'll see, as we added more of the segment servers, our query times dropped and our access times also became shorter.